Ooh. Hello and welcome to the first episode of Wow Adventures. And what I will be doing is I will make a new character and we we will it's a sort of a let's play. But before I start, I'll just let you guys know that uh, I will be playing World of Warcraft Cataclysm. I didn't get Pandaria yet because I'm not sure I will. I want to play the game uh, continuously. I do have some experience playing the game. I've had a level 80 character before, but that was back in the days of Wrath of the Lich King. I, I don't know what happened to my account or to my character so I bought the game again because I missed I missed questing and you know character development and whatnot and since I've bought it again I've first started with a shaman it's a, a pondering shaman just because well they seemed like fun and they were a new class and then I got him to 33 and then I got bored of him. Well, not not bored, but I started playing that with my brother, and I made a warlock, and I got him to 31. And this is a, just a test character. This is my troll druid. So, what did I want to say? Oh, as I said, I I've played WoW before. And yeah, these are my noob characters. And let's do. Let's do. Create a new character. Uh, what I wanted to do now is. I think. Let's do. Choose a name. I will be playing uh, Undead and an Undead Hunter. I've thought about going with Troll Hunter, but uh, why would you go Troll Hunter and I just want to go with Undead? <coughs> I don't remember the Undead being able to choose a Hunter class, nor the Tower and the Paladin, Paladins. Okay. Oh yeah, I also played a bit with, uh, with the Goblin, but the Goblin Hunter. Eh, eh. He's so small. And I don't like their starting zone at all. So I'll just go with Undead. Uh, so let's let's begin this. And why Hunter? Well mainly because it's the only class I've never really played that much. Nor did I play a warrior, but I'm not in the mood for close up fighting. I'll just go with Hunter. Let's customize our guy. Let's see. I don't like this face. Where's it? Where's it? Wow. Wow. Oh my god, you're so hideous. Oh man. No, I don't want any crazy features. Let's see. Yeah, okay, this is. We'll go with this at first. Let's pick his skin color. Is there any significant. Oh, we can go with hot green. Hmm. Yeah, I think we're gonna go with uh, let's go with zombie green. This is zombie green. Okay. Let's pick his face. Why are you holding a crossbow and not a pistol? Okay, let's pick his face. Ooh. Oh, he's so angry. As for why I'm uh, choosing an undead, well, I said I, uh, I don't remember them being able to choose to choose a hunter as a character role. So it should be fun. Hopefully, it will be fun. And one more thing. Uh, 
just to keep uh, things interesting and maintain a bit of a I can't call it vanilla flavor feeling of old I won't be uh, using the dungeon finder as much because those two other characters I've had the the shaman and uh, the warlock I have made them in like four days and when I started playing it was a lot harder leveling and yeah things changed a bit the game has become a lot more uh, noob friendly so let's see what face ooh let's, let's get some marks on him good good you should be angry let's pick some funny hair should we do it cool hair yeah yeah let's go with the mohawk yeah crazy hunter we just go to bald guy bald hunter sounds good to me hair color well uh, nothing that matters at all let's see will we give him any features should he have no lower mouth uh, ooh it's a zombie yeah Ooh, his eyes. He doesn't have any eyes, does he? Okay, let's give him no mouth. So he can't talk. Damn, you're ugly, son. It's okay. It's okay, we got this. So, what will he be his name? Let's think of a name. Hmm. Let's think of a name. Oh, I can't use life heat. How about? Hmm. Hmm. Let's find it. an obscure Greek god. list of hunting deities ooh that's african anglo-saxon aztec egyptian finnish let's go with finnish mythology aristeos god of beekeeping goddess goddess heracles kinagidas lelantos orion rundas and hit it Hit it, mythology, god of the hunt and the good fortune. Oh, that's good. That sounds good. Rundas, Rundas. Rundas. So almost sounds as round as. Oh, crap. It's unavailable. Mix Quattl. Mix Quattl. As the god of hunting. Ooh. That sounds interesting. Mix Coatel. Mix Quattle. Mix Quattle. Mix Quattle. It's a strange name. But hey, it's the Aztec God of Haunting. So we'll go with that. Finish. Oh man, his name is unavailable. And I'm sorry if uh, raising my voice will kill your ears hmm. Bendis, goddess of the hunt Ipabog Wendish, god of the hunt in Sla Slavic mythology Podaga uh, that's interesting name, Podaga Wendish, god of the welter weather, fishing, hunting and farming, let's see, is Podaga available? Podaga Damn. Okay. Let's see. In Inuit mythology, there's this guy, Decade Sertok, god of hunter and master of Karibu. That's. Oh, reindeers. Okay. Let's go with this guy. I'll copy, just copy paste his name. Oh, we're missing a letter. Crap. Just one letter. Mm. 
Woden, leader of the wild hunt. Ooh, <coughs> in African mythology, Konovum is the supreme god of the Mbuti Pygmy people in Central Africa, and his name is the Great Hunter. Do I, I think this thing will be already taken. Let's see. Kono. Oh my god, what the hell? Okay, Aorion will definitely be taken. Yeah, there's this guy in Greek mythology, Aristeus, and he's the god of beekeeping, cheese making, herding, olive growing, and hunting. Uh, I doubt his name will be available. Aristeus. Oh, why? Okay, let's try a different site. Uh, list of gods and goddesses. Major gods and goddesses of the world. Okay. Let's see if we can find an interesting god or goddess name. Don Demeter, Frigg, Freya, Fortuna, Keongsi, Guanin, Kaori, Kaori. What's your name? I'm Kaori. Kaori. Oh, is the wife of the god Shiva. He presents purity and start austerity. Guari. Wife of the god Shiva. Huh. Okay, let's see. Is Guari available? Yes, Guari is good. Yeah, although it's a, uh, it's a uh, what's it called? A goddess name. Doesn't matter. It's, it's the wife of a god. This. I'm not sure, but I like the name Guari, so we'll go with that. Alright, let's begin our adventure. I will let the screen plays and everything play. Though Lady Sylvanas and her Forsaken finally took vengeance upon their hated enemy, the Lich King, their dark crusade in Northrend proved costly. Betrayed by Grand Apothecary Putris at the Battle of Wrathgate, the Forsaken's devious plague of death was unleashed upon both the Alliance and the Horde to calamitous effect. Unbeknownst to Sylvanas, Putris and his demonic ally, Veramathris, had taken control of the Undercity. As a result, the Forsaken were wrongly blamed for the traitor's atrocities. Though the Undercity was eventually retaken, Sylvanas and her followers still bear the weight of Putra's sins. Mistrusted by the other members of the Horde, the Forsaken must now prove their loyalty to the cause and redeem themselves from their supposed treachery. To this end, Sylvanas has bolstered her defenses within the Tyrus Fall Glades and readied her undead forces for any contingency. As one of the Forsaken, you must use your cunning and viciousness to slay any who would pose a threat to Sylvanas' rule, be they human, undead, or otherwise. Okay, let's stop the damage counter. And what the hell? Ooh, he's. I'm sleeping apparently. That's not me. Who's that guy? That's not me. Reach around the awakener. Yeah, that's not me. Rise, quarry. Welcome back to the realm of the living. With the blessing and power of the dark lady, I have freed you from death's grip. You are no slave, quarry. You are free to follow what, follow whatever path you choose. From here, if you choose to serve the dark lady, Sylvanas, I recommend you speak with Undertaker Mortal. You will find him behind me in the graveyard. Okay. Okay, let's go and talk to 
this guy. Uh, before I do that, I will. I would like to. Where is it? Interface. Activate all my action bars. There we go. I always enjoy playing with having all my action bars. And let's talk to this guy, Mordo. Speak quickly. Hello there, you must be Glory. Well, I am. I am pleased to see that you're up and walking around, Glory. You've held up nicely, especially after being dead for so long. You don't say, I'm missing my face. What the hell is wrong with you? Yeah, hideous, Glory, hideous. Others weren't as lucky. If you wouldn't mind, I need you to fetch my embalming fluid and some twine to stitch up these bodies. You'll find both in the shadow grave, the building just behind me. Here, Darnell will join you. He knows the way. Okay. Farewell. Let's see, I just saw a corpse with a jaw that would fit you. I don't want the jaw. I'm fine without a jaw. What do you require? Oh. Oh, okay. Let's go and find some embalming fluid and twine, corpse stitching twine. What's this? Take embalming fluid. Good. And there's the twine. And there's this guy. There's this head. Ooh, interesting. Speak quickly. Last time I played an undead. Oh, this guy is big. Last time I played with the undead, uh, you you woke up in this this place, and the first quest would be uh, was called the Rude Awakening. That's why I, I named my first episode of our Let's Play, whatever, A Rude Awakening. Okay, let's see. You will find the items within the Shadow Grave. I believe I left them on my work table. Oh, okay. Exactly what I needed. You will be an asset to the Forsaken Warrior. You know, word has it that you were quite the hunter in your previous life. Perhaps I could assign you to a more exciting task. Yeah, you should probably do that. The, v the Valkyr raised hundreds of corpses every day. Agatha raised you just a few moments ago. Not all are as lucky as you, however. Some maintain a free will, but live in constant fear and confusion. They usually run off into the woods, covering at their own infection. Cowering at their own infection. Others lose their minds completely, shambling about aimlessly. They often run to violence and must be destroyed. This is your task, Wari. Destroy them. Our former brothers and sisters thought they might be. Though they might be. Okay, let's kill some zombies. Trust no one. I'm a zombie. You have to excuse my uh You'll have to excuse my reading skills, they aren't they aren't very good. Mostly because I'm not used to reading things aloud. Sorry about this, but I don't know where it is. 
So I don't care. They'll just decline them. Oh, that's how it works. Okay, one more zombie to be killed. Ooh, crit. Let's go hand in our little quest. Hello. Choose my reward. Should I, I want a cloak? Good, let's take a cloak and then level two. Yeah, I have a cloak now. Still don't have a job, but uh, at least I got a cloak. And you are caretaker case. I'm Gory. Who are you? Oh God! It begins. You will receive ten experience. Awakening. King, peasant, or hunter. I don't care what you were before. I just need somebody with a working tongue. Well, good sir, I don't have a tongue. Being raised from the dead is strenuous. Not everyone copes with it as well as you did. In particular, there are three newly risen undead who are having trouble coping right now. I want you to find them and talk to them. Uh, it might be that they just need someone that they can relate with. You'll find them here in the graveyard. Okay, let's go talk with some undead people. Let's start with the top guy. His name is Valdred Mori, and he is he's kneeing for some reason. He's on his knees. What is it? Oh God! Stop it! Yeah, this is annoying. System. Oh man, where do I stop this constant spam? Oh god, how to disable guild invites in WoW. Oof, go to interface. Okay, interface. So, interface. Oh, did I? On, on the controls is a box. Lock guild invites. Lock. Okay. Okay, so, what's going on? Who are you? What happened to me? Don't you remember? You died. I, I died. Yes, you're right, I died. It was an orb. But he cut off my hands and left me to die. Father looks down at his hands. These aren't my hands. These aren't my hands. Calm down. Valdred, undertake a more to probably suit some new ones for you. Valdred looks back down at his hands. Suppose this is my fate then. Ah. Part of an undead army. Somehow I never considered that I might end up fighting for the Forsaken. He looks back up at me. What do I do now? What do you do now? You will talk to Undertaker Mordo. He'll tell you what to do. That's all I know. Farewell. A poor guy. I see. Well done. Let's go to work. Quarry. Dark Lady needs us, right? I'm sure she does. I'm sure she does. Okay, this is Lillian Voss. I'm listening. 
Get away from me, you abomination. I'm not an abomination, I'm simply undead. I just want to speak with you. To you. Speak with you. The undead are taint upon Azeroth. Every one of your creatures deserves to be destroyed. Lillian, do you realize that you are undead yourself? Because she didn't. You're dying. My father will protect me. Well, I guess Lillian went cuckoo. She's a bit insane now. I know you never heard from her again. Some say she she's living her days in the green pastures of those bread foothills. And this guy is Marshal Ratbath. Stand back, monster. You want to fight? Because I'll fight you. I'll fight anyone, any one of your of you creatures. Do you hear me? I'm not here to fight. I've only been asked to speak with you. Oh really? Fine. I don't want you to join you and your Forsaken. Maybe I'll start my own Forsaken. Maybe I'll invade Forsaken with elbows. You're free to do whatever you like. Okay. You're all butt hurt, a bit butt hurt from dying and you know, stuff like that. Mm hmm. Okay, we've done this. Let's see what do we get as a reward. Let's put the carpet thing here. Revive pet, put that there. And let's put cannibalize there. Cane okay, shot is good there. And you are. Awakening. <coughs> If done well, Hunter, as you can see, not all of us have resigned to our fates. I'm glad to see that you're at least willing to work. All red will be a valuable asset to the Forsaken. As for the other two, there is not much we can do. We cannot force them to join us. Okay. Dornell tells me that the two of you have already met. That's good, because I'm sending you both into death deal. Death now. Your work here your work is done here. Speak with Death Guards, Saltane and Death now to the north. He will tell you more of what you must know. Okay, let's go and speak to that guy. And I have a spider as a pet. Can I rename him? Yeah. I will name you. I will name you. Best pet ever. Yes. Nice. <laughs> okay. Let's talk to the death card self. Those Valkyr have been really busy resurrecting new newbies lately. <laughs> I've already seen a couple dozen new bodies run down that hill since this morning. You, however, are the most promising hunter I've seen today. I bet you tell this to all the hunters, but that doesn't matter right now. Beware, We've been shipping in dead bodies from Silver Spine, Hillsbred, hell, anywhere we can get them from. We can't, however, afford to ignore the bodies which are s sitting right in front of our doorstep. The last vestiges of the Scarlet Crusade roam here in Tyrus Glades. While, while we've managed to push them from death now, several of their bodies li lift their, litter the buildings to the north and the east. Go find them, and bring that to Darnell fellow with you. He looks strong enough to carry a few corpses. Okay, let's find some corpses. Now let's pick up the other quest from... 
Shadow Priest Sardis Scourge and our perimeter If you're going to be an asset to the Forsaken you need to learn how to fight And there's no better target than the Scourge minions that continue to pass the rust The wretched ghouls and rattlegate skeletons that roam the north and the east our former troopers of the Fallen Scourge, they should prove to be an even match for a fledgling hunter like you. Do not tarry, when you are done speak to me again. Okay, let's go kill some stuff and gather some corpses. Trainers, we don't care about some. Oh, the, are these the guys we have to kill? Yeah. Good. Mana. More mana is always good. Ratchet Ghoul. That take my arcane shot. <laughs> Die. Good, good. find a better name for our pet because the best pet ever might be a good name but we need, a, we need another good name what would you ask of death There's a corpse, pick it up. What? Can you pick six of them up? Yeah, pick it up. There. There, yeah, pick it up. Nice, nice. Let's find some more. Why aren't there any more corpses laying around? Pick them up. What's your name? Darnell. Good. You're a strong guy, aren't you? And there's a fourth one? Good guy. Good guy, Darnell. Help me, help me pick up corpses since today. Here's the fifth one. Come on. I know you can do it. Here we go. <laughs> it's a bit funny. <laughs> oh, don't mind us, we're just a couple of undead zombies walking around with corpses. It's okay. Good, good, good. Ooh, this is, we have to go this way. to death god saltine then you have a lot of hp is that like 7 million i think okay okay it worked Corey. i knew you weren't useless I... okay here take one of these we death guards have piles of these things just sitting around well do we want another cape no, let's take the belt. Trust no one. Okay. Okay. And 
now let's return to the shadow priest and tell tell him we've killed. You're going in strength, Wari. I've seen your type before. You will be moving out of death now. Death now and on to greater things before long. Just make sure you don't uh, lose sight of where you started. Okay, let's get it. Scavenge unique. Nice, we leveled up. We got a new skill. Study shot that causes 66% 60, weapon damage plus 9. Generates focus. And this uses focus. 14. Okay. So let's have things that generate there. Things that use them there. Then you can press 1. Okay, good, 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 good. Trail. One scroll. Ah. While you were off dealing with a mindless scourge, this scroll arrived for you. I would think it's some matter of importance as it seems it bears the seal of the hunter trainer Xavier. I would take some time to read it before heading out again. Okay, let's talk to Novice Elrath. The truth of the grave. Early alone I saw a young forsaken woman running towards the old den. She was screaming for her life, pleading to be taken back home. Not all of us are as resolute as others, Gory. Even so, we must accept our fate as undead if we are to rise up against those that would put us down. Take my hand mirror and show it to the young woman. She needs to see what she really is and join us in our cause. Besides, we can use all the bodies that we can get. Goodbye. Okay. So before we go and show the crazy lady we just talked at the first time in the mirror, we shall, we shall read the scroll. As Forsaken, we fight against the Lich King. We fight against the Alliance. Sometimes we even quarrel with the other races of the Horde. We are few and we face great obstacles, but we will survive and prevail. As a fellow hunter, you will do so from afar, with a bow in your hands and, and, and an animal companion at your side. Your power comes not from the arcane wizardry of martial prowess, but your ability to live off the land. The path of the hunter lies before you. It starts with me, your trainer. Where it ends, we do not know yet. Okay. Show Lillian her reflection. Where is Lillian? Large N. Is this the end? Let's show her reflection. Lillian Wallace. Oh yeah, this is the crazy lady we we talked to the first time. I am Get away from me, you monster. Don't look at me, I'm hideous. Oh, you're not hideous, Lillian. You're one of us here. Look in this mirror, see for yourself. Victory for Sylvanas. Oh no, I want to dead. You don't understand. I can't be undead. Not me. Not now. Ah, she's still cuckoo. She's still a bit crazy. Let's go tell. Let's go tell Elra that our plan failed. What is it? You say she ran away, what a shame. Very well, as long as she's maintained her free will, there's still hope. Okay, the 
executor in the field. I can keep you busy here in town all week, but you seem to be more the fighting type. Uh, she looks over me and nods. Yes, you'll do just fine. I'd like you to go to talk to Executor Oren. Follow the path north out of death now. You'll find him not far past past the barricades. Well, let's talk to Executor Oren. But before we do that, I will check if anyone's watching the stream. Nope. I'm talking to myself, but it's okay. It's okay. Ooh. Oh, it's okay, yeah, yeah. Let's talk to Xavier, the huntsman. He sent us a nice little letter. Have you come from training, hunter? Ah, so you've arrived. Good. I overheard that a few others were able to escape death and were heading into town. Perhaps that resilience will pay off in the future also. You may thank Sylvanas for your freedom. Freedom of mind and body. Though you still remain tortured by the plague and its effects, you are now free to come and go as you see fit. Okay, I will be here to train you as you grow in experience. Find me as often as you like. I charge a minimal fee, but you'll find everything I can teach you to be worthwhile. Go now and test your skill. Many more things will become known to you as you gain experience, some of which I am unable to discuss with you here. Just know that Sylvanas will need hunters with your type of cunning in the future. You will be the backbone of our salvation. Do not forget it. Okay. The thrill of the hunt. I've been told that I'm supposed to train you how to be a hunter. That's all well and good, but in my opinion you'll get uh, more training out in the field than you will talking about theories with me. Go out, get some more experience and see if you can if you learn any new tricks. Then you can come back and show me. Okay, we have to practice study shots on the dummy. Okay, where are the dummies? Where are the training dummies? Ooh, they are here. There we go. Study shot. Steady shot. And we have to do it one more time. Okay. You seem to be somewhat of a natural god. Gory, this is good. Embrace the shadow. It's good to know that I am such a great hunter. to Executor, okay, this is Aaron. What, is it? what do we have here? A new hunter ready for battle, eh? I am ready for battle. First of all, look at your armor. You're a mess hunter. 
If you like to stay in one piece, and I've no doubt you do, perhaps I can help. If you can gather some paw and wings from the wolves and bats nearby, maybe I find, I'll find some armor for you. You'll find the creatures to the north and to the west of here. Okay. Let's kill some enemies. There's dust bat. Mm. We also got the bat eye. These are the scavengers. Oh, let's pick up all the trash. Dusk bat wing. Let's not kill that guy. There's a fellow I'm dead. Well, we don't need spider limbs, we just need some. One more bat wing. Yeah, let's kill the rat. Fuck you, rat. The rat has left the building. Okay, and let's kill some more rats. What? First, I need to kill one, two more wolves. Yeah, let's not pick up all the trash. So we don't want to have that much space. Oh. Okay. We've done that. Let's turn the quest in. Ooh, 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 okay, it's this way. Do try your best to keep yourself unharmed until I get you s until I get you some armor. Okay. Thank you, Ari. This armor should help you out. Damn. Hopefully, it should do, do you more good than the last one to wear it. One moment, please. Let's get the bat battle belt. We <laughs> leveled up. Got a new. What? What's tracking? Tracking interface. Okay. One of your greatest struggles is obtaining the natural resources we need to survive. Gold was scarce in Lordaeron, in Lordaeron, even in the height of the Atlantis power so many years ago. There is a gold mine to the west that has been overrun with spiders. We need gold from the mine, but we can't very well get in 
get it while the spiders are crawling around in there. I have not much manpower to commit to the task, so we'll just have to do it little by little. Get up there and see what you can do for us. Okay, let's go and kill some spiders. Spider killing time. And I almost thought to myself for a second right there. Ooh. Sorry, I've been walking toward the tree. Okay, these are the spider guys. Let's kill them all. We don't want the trash, we just want the cash. experience and hello there whoever you might be it will be weird if I talk to people on on Twitch chat no it won't be weird who cares Tire. There we go. Hopefully this will be a bit better. And let's find some nightweb spiders. There we go. There they are. watching because it is like for me. No joke at all. Now we're not going to do it. 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 One more spider and we're off. It's a bit spider. I don't know the rest of it. Let's go back to death now. These woods remind me of uh, remind me of the forest in uh, Path of Exile, where you, where you had to kill the what's his name? Yeah, I can't remember. I 
and also if anyone's watching just feel free to say hi don't be so shy one moment Alright, well, to start, it'll take a few weeks or months to fill clean out the infestation. After that, we'll have to get down there with some torches to burn away the webbing. You've done your duty well. Thank you, punk haired guy. Punk haired executor guy. Ooh, we got a new bow. That's good. Weapons are always nice. Crossbow. Yeah. No better than the zombies. While you were inside that cave, your big friend Arnold came came by with some alarming news. Since the Valky arrived, we've seen more and more undead that chose not to join our forces under the banner of the Dark Lady. They've been gathering at a small camp here in the valley, and now they've organized forces. They plan to attack Deathnail, Deathnail Hunter. Darnell is just down the road to the east. Be careful, while those undead aren't completely blameless. They are still not quite right in the head. Okay, let's go kill some friends. Some undead friends, well they're not friends, but yeah. they could have been friends. Oh yeah. Steven. Oh, where's let's go to Darnell first. Oh dear big guy. With the big sword and the big shield. Corey, you made it! You see those run tents up there? That's what that's where we are headed. The battle's probably already started. Whoa. I don't need a weapon. Why would you give me a weapon? Just got the weapon. Let's go with the deck. Assault on the rot brain in Kaplan. While you were taking care of matters for Executor Aaron, I went off on an assignment of my own. Shadow Priest Sarvis asked me to peek in on the Rotbrain camp. There's a reason why they're called Rotbrains. Their leader goes by the name of Marshall Redpath, and he's an absolute beast. And, uh, that's one of the guys we talked to in the beginning. Look, Quarry, the attack is starting. You're better in command than I am. Get in there and help out. When you're done, meet up with Shadow Priest Tarvis in the chapel. Good luck. Oh, let's go kill some. Someone dead. Samuel Flips.
Hát, hogy egyen. Igen? Aha. Miért? Hogy utolérlek. Being born again under the power of a Valkyr is a strenuous process. Many don't survive the shock, turning into zombies or ghouls. Others retain just enough humanity to seem normal on the outside, but they're sick inside. We should have slain those rot brains the day, were, the day they were raised. As for you, your strong hunter, Quarry, I knew you do well. You'll be needed. You'll be headed out of death now soon. Okay. Oh, we need to choose a reward. No utter. What gear? Oh, there now will be a death card. I'll probably be staying here in death now. If things work out, though, who knows? Maybe I'll get to meet the Dark Lady herself. How about you? I've heard that Sarvis is going to send you off to Calston Estate. Big assignment, eh? Well, I won't hold you up. It's been a pleasure, Quarry. I hope our paths paths cross again soon. Bye bye, Darnell. Bye bye. No other race on Azeroth has suffered as much as our people, Hunter. To laugh in the face of death has become second nature for all of us. Sarvis produces a piece of paper from within his robes. These. Sorry about that. These will be these will need to be taken to my field agent, Death Guard Simmer. This information contains the whereabouts of the last few holdouts from the Scarlet Crusade. We will destroy these crusaders once and for all. And I have a feeling you'll be instrumental in that effort. Take the road north out of death now. Soon after entering Tirisval proper, Tirisval proper, you'll see a large man, mansi, mansion, mansi. I don't know what a mansi is. Steamers inside. Okay. Well, 
this will be this will be the end of episode one rude awakening and next time we meet we will continue our epic adventure with our newly made hunter see you guys next time thanks for tuning in